hello guys and welcome to a brand new video today i'm here with akira now this is one show which i always thought about checking out but i never like checked it out it was like one of those shows and um like i, I i've heard that this is quite good you know and i've heard a lot of praise from a lot of people about this show so i'm quite interested to check what this is about i am really not sure what you know like i've not even read the summary of the movie so it's like completely something <clears throat> like you know new to me so yeah this is kind of like uh like a blind reaction and i'm quite excited to check this out like this like what this movie is actually about like why people praise it so much what is uh like you know like how is this so exceptional i want to really uh, like check it out and i think this is pretty old i'm not sure when it came out but i'm i think it's pretty old so yeah uh, let's see this and also another thing i should mention uh, i don't know how much i'll be able to talk in this video because <clears throat> my throat is sore and uh, i don't know i'll try my best to talk but like uh like discussion and everything might be a little bit less today i know i'll try my best like when my th throat starts hurting i'll probably stop you know so like talking stop talking so yeah so anyways guys so let's get started with this uh video now i've recently completed all the ghibli movies so as i said in the previous video that i will start all of these you know these movies these uh like normal movies which i have not seen the popular ones so like yeah like i'll keep the movie day you know they like this uh, day every week will be the movie day unless and until i run out of movies you know <laughs> which will take a little bit while i'm guessing it will take probably a year for me to like run out of all movies so let's see if i can like you know <laughs> like if i can like like you know like uh, reach a day when there'll be like no movie left for me to react to no anime movie left for me to react to <laughs> yeah that's like the target for me so anyways without further ado let's get started with akira all right i'll be putting the subtitles and the timer here sync it to whichever is your preference and let's get started <clears throat> all right so here's the countdown three two one go Akira commit. Yeah, the art style is looking old, so this might be quite a while ago, you know, this came out. 1988, Tokyo. <clears throat> Damn. Oh. Whoa, what the? Written and directed by Katsuhiro Otomoto. <laughs> what is that? Oh, okay. The landscape. Damn, this is like a lot of bridges I can see. 31 years after World War 3 World War 3 What? So, so this is like a Like a kind of like a thing in the future which happens, but it's it was written 2019 Okay, obviously 2019 is a lot in the future when this came out, but now it's like in the past Kind of weird to think about it. <clears throat> Whoa, everything's broken and tidy. Unemployed worker. <clears throat> Writing across the country. Oh my god. Three peanuts? What? Oh, damn. 
Oh! Long Bastard's Root 5. Hmm. Damn. Dog piss. Damn, the bike. It's like one of those bikes you see in the cyber, you know, cyberpunk kind of movies and games. Tetsuo. <clears throat> the stolen bikes. Whoa, what's happening? Damn. It's weird, like you can see all of these futuristic things and at the same time they're like watching television, like those, you know, old televisions. So Oh, what? Whoa. Oh, damn. Oh, so these are like biker gangs, you know those biker gangs that like Oh, great. Wow. Yeah, yeah, those biker gangs we we see in animes. Ora, ora. Oh no, someone's coming cry. Yeah. Uh. Damn. Oh. Fell down. <laughs> what is <it> like a <laughs> Oh Wow And there comes a steel pipe Oh Damn Oh Oh, it's parking again. 150 kilometer. And there you go. He lost control. Damn, he has weird tattoos, like smiling faces. <laughs> And the police is here. And he's running away. Okay, so the guy who's like uh, riding the normal bike, his name is Tetsuo. Whoa. Huh. Damn. What's happening here? What is he like clutching his stomach? Did he get stabbed or something? Yeah, he, he, he's stabbed. Like... 
Whoa, the dogs are following him. Following the blood trail. He's either stabbed or shot. Oh, damn, what the? Shot. Oh. Okay, like. Oh, it's like the riots are like breaking out everywhere and what's this weird noise that's happening yeah he's bleeding oh my god he's losing blood Okay. Oh, damn, he has good aim. Oh, okay. Wait, that's a kid? I thought that's an old man. What's happening? So this guy was protecting? Oh no. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Uh, uh Damn. Yeah, he sounds like a child, but he looks like an old man. Whoa! What the hell? He shouted and everything started breaking apart? Okay, weird stuff are happening. Old city. Okay, it's been 10 minutes and I have no clue what's happening. Ah, uh, wow. Oh boy, they, uh, yeah, yeah, the ride is going on. Okay. Oh boy. This is K and this is, no, this is Ru, that is Ru and this is K. Oh, what the? That's not how you use a smoke bomb? What the hell? What? Oh. 
Oh! Oh! Okay, well. Yeah, um. Oh! God damn. Oh! Damn, what is happening here? Like. So this kid is weird, like he's screaming things are breaking and then the whole motorbike got like wrecked before reaching him. Is he okay? Like Hurt? What? Oh great, now the... Another weird kid, that kid, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Are they aliens or something? Like what? You can't survive on the earth. It seems as if they're like aliens or something. Oh, damn. Okay. Okay, like, listen to them. Yeah, they have guns pointed at you. What will they do with Tetsu? Like... Hmm. He's like weird floating like couch. His couch is floating. Oh boy. Oh no, he's bleeding, yeah. Okay, his name is Kaneda. Huh. Uh, this is probably fine, like, you know, it doesn't seem like he got much injuries. It's like bleeding from the mouth. So they captured him or took him in. Oh. Oh, third Tokyo Olympics. <laughs> what? This is your dying mother. Whoa.
Oh, this is uh, that gay. Oh, what the? Oh, he has a grenade in his hand. What the? Oh, oh. run. Oh, the dud. <laughs> okay, like dispose of that grenade, whatever that is. Damn. It's like it's like it's Whoops. Yeah, what happened to this tool? What? Th that's your problem? <laughs> okay, whatever. <laughs> Damn, it's like a... Why did they take the girl with them? Yeah, what about him? What? That was the reason? Oh, he's... <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, this is uh, that guy. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, and she's gone. <laughs> oh, wow, another explosion. It's a mole. <laughs> wow. Hmm. Yeah, what happened to Tetsu? Like, they like forgot about him completely. Like, what? Now, like, they're like doing some kind of experiments on him or what? Hmm. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, he got into contact with it. Akira Spatter. All thing they would do. Oh. Uh, 
addition to the numbers okay so i'm guessing that so that little kid was is called akira if we use like if there's power of god wow wow great This is a school? It's like a hangout of ruffians. Wow, what? Damn, damn, damn. Okay. What? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> they completely forgot about this zoo. Like what? Oh. Okay. <laughs> wow. Oh. Okay, yeah, all right. Face with the cook. Oh, I don't think anyone is like concerned about him. I'm guessing uh, the the the, guy, the other guy was a little bit concerned. Yeah, they're experimenting upon you. Okay. My burning desire to study. What happened? Oh. Wait, is that Tesu? <laughs> he stole his bike and ran away? What? Oh my god. Oh, who is this? Oh, great. Other bike biker gang members. Oh, no. Out of patrol or something? Out of fuel? Oh. 
yeah start start running oh oh no oh my god god damn oh Ah, oh, great. Yeah, they're like, it's like the, the grudge they have. Ah, oh, great. Wow. Great. Oh! Oh my god. Oh, they're here! Thank god. Damn! He just... Oh! Wow. Oh yeah, they're beating him up. Wait, what's happening? Wait, Tetsu is beating them up? I thought it was the other way around. Oh, this is um Oh, this is uh, that guy. Okay. Oh. Whoa. Oh god. Oh my god. What? So oh, he's like oh, what? What's that? He's hallucinating? Blue pattern And there you go <sighs> Let's come to retrieve him Okay. Oh great, yeah. You can't do anything over here. Damn, he like... At least he was not violent, you know. Like there are like some security people who just beat up people just for the sake of it. Whoa! <laughs> wow, great. Hmm. 
<laughs> Kanita is not in the mood. Uh, another explosion. Oh, wow. Now what? Oh, wow. Okay, what? Oh, that guy. And that uh, girl as well. Yeah, this was gone. Uh, Canada's gone. <laughs> okay. Okay. Damn. Whoa. Just barely grazed her her head. Huh. Damn. Okay. Oh. Damn. Okay, run. Oh boy. And again they're testing on him. Oh, this must be that boy. So his name is Akira, this this little kid who we saw. Whoa. Damn. Oh. Oh, that was, wait a minute. What? Oh, these are the numbered, like they are telling, like. They're like kids, but their appearance is like old. We met Akira. Yeah. Yoko, so this girl can predict futures, I'm guessing. This power is...
Yeah, predominative power. To act or not to act. Wow. Okay. On the That's it. Oh, so they're like thinking like this is like an evolution that they're going through. <laughs> yeah. Taking thirty long years. Scientists will not understand. One forty eight degrees Kelvin. Oh, wow, like the ice is breaking. Ah. Okay, wow. <laughs> okay, what is this? Last of the civilization and science we had created. Lit of the Pandora's box. Akira, oh. Okay, this guy is. Come on, Canada. Wow, this guy is... Oh, there he is. Yeah. Okay, th this guy is annoying me. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Damn. Okay. Damn, they have like fake passes.
Oh, about a Tetsuo. Twenty-six. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Neo Tokyo. This guy also looks like another one of those numbered ones. Wind, which will make it fall. The wind called Akia. Yeah. Oh, these guys are like, uh, damn. Or further funding with them. Wow. Whoa, they're like... Oh, the last one was called Cosplay Akira. Yeah, he... <laughs> they're like fighting with each other. <laughs> Sleeping. <laughs> So they are like, uh, like the upper, you know, like the upper leaders or something, like who like run the country. Like these people, I can also see that guy who was like uh, walking with Ryu. This guy, isn't it? Or am I mistaken? Kind of look the same. Oh, there is that well. Oh, 
Oh! Convenient! <laughs> so he can kind of control his power now. Or maybe not. What the? Okay. Infiltration. <laughs> okay, Canada is also with them. Yeah, they kind of like talked about it. Like, we'll use him as a decoy if we. These things uh, turn problematic. What the? Ooh! <laughs> what the? Oh, great! He has friends with him. Is this some kind of hallucination he's seeing? Must be. Yeah, this must be some kind of hallucination. Prum, 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 prum. <laughs> and they're gone. Yes, hallucination. Oh, wow. They're having a party in his bedroom. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> What's he crying mayonnaise or what? <laughs> like, what? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Damn, weird hallucinations you have. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Lego pieces. Oh. <laughs> Damn. What is that? Milk or mayonnaise? <laughs> like. Milk is milk. <laughs> okay. Oh, that must have hurt. Yeah. Oh! Oh my god! So these guys are scared of blood? Yeah. Oh. Wow. Oh, so they were trying to get into his head or something and they're afraid of blood. So these are like the numbered. Yeah, yeah, that, that other uh, guy who was like, like sitting on a couch and that girl with like future predicting abilities and the other like boy. And he really got hurt. That means, yeah, like it was not full hallucination. Like was kind of damn <clears throat> oh does he have clairvoyance like that type of an ability or something Imatetsu. Oh, so there are these like so there are so many of the numbered <clears throat> yeah like oh 
Oh my god, he, he's probably going to mess them up. Yeah, ah, damn. Wow. <clears throat> they were too careless with him, you know, like, they knew what ca he's capable of, but they still, like, came with only two bodyguards. That's it. Yeah, like, keep quiet. Hide! What the hell are you doing? Yeah! Oh, damn. Yeah! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Okay, I don't blame him for this. If I see something like that in front of me, I would also react like this. Oh great, again, run! What is that, drone? Some kind of? Oh! Oh damn. Weaponized drones. Oh my god, they, they lost one, one person. Oh no, that's not a drone. What is that? Oh! The hand was attached to the gun! Okay, that's not a drone. That's a man. Oh my god, they have a Gatling gun! Okay! It's no use. Damn. Okay, another one. Oh, oh. <laughs> Even if you find that gun, nothing you can do with it. Like, this thing has a Gatling gun. Oh, damn! <laughs> oh, is he going to get on this? Yeah, yeah, he's going to get on it. Damn! Oh! Ah, uh, that was risky. Oh, great. <coughs> Sorry about that. Central wiring. Okay. Yeah, it's just like your bike, you know? <laughs> Except this flies. Yeah, he broke out. Baby room. Okay, they're using smoke grenades. But it won't be of any use because he has like a telekinetic force field that'll just like squash you. Yeah, look at him, like <laughs> and there you go. Yeah, he's out of control. Great. <laughs> he's mad. Damn. 
They're using sniper rifle at close combat. Like what? Okay, uh, yeah. That's what I thought. Okay, this is the baby room, I'm guessing? Yeah, like I'm guessing uh, the other numbered kids are here. Or like at least one of them is here. Oh, they're like the Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Oh, hello there. Prum Prum is back. It's one of the numbered kids, I'm guessing. And there's another one. <laughs> yeah. He's too strong. You know, these kids are like nothing in front of him. Yeah, the girl, where is she? Oh. So this is, his name is Takashi. Oh boy, he's pissed. Yeah, he, he came into contact with that kid, uh, so the Takashi kid, I guess. What? Oh my god, someone's controlling him, her. Yeah, that girl. So, she not only has this uh, prerogative ability but also can control people yes he remembers um i don't think it's going to be of any use Oh, great. Yeah, he's a lot stronger. Okay. Oh. Well, yeah, like, what else do you think? <laughs> okay. What? Oh. Big big person. So these these were like kids when they they're like using their power. More powerful than that. Oh, so Akira is another person who is still not awakened or something. Oh no. Yeah, this is what happens when you experiment on people, you know? Like, if there's someone somehow gets pissed off, that's... <laughs> Wow, level seven. <laughs> They're here. Get out of the way. I think this is the first time someone 
pointed a Gatling gun at someone and said that put your hands up. <laughs> you know? Oh, damn. Oh! Move! Yes. Oh god. Oh wow. He's going on a rampage. Ah. Okay. And he's going to get pissed at that. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah, he is. Oh, great. Okay. Yeah, he is a bit too gone. Olympic Stadium. And he's gone, yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah, great. Ah, uh, this is not here, by the way. Oh, God. So he must have, like, read their mind or something. They're connected somehow, I'm guessing. What? She knows her? Hmm. Like dead or alive, something like that, yeah. Catch him dead or alive. Oh, who is this? Supreme Executive Council's decision. Oh, great. Probably the only person who could have like went and stopped them. Oh, <laughs> he's like shoot them. 
Oh, wow. I don't think they're, they're going to listen to you. Oh, they're listening to him. Uh, maybe not. Wow, this guy like took control. Capsule. What's the capsule? Have drug? Okay, will he even pay? I don't think he's going to pay. Oh great, he must have killed that guy or something like that. Yeah, he wrecked the whole place. Yep. What happened to the guy? Oh, he beat him up. Oh, he's dead, wow. This was here. Yeah, he's too far gone. Yeah, you can fly. Why do you need a bike? <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah. Oh god. He's like... Oh, they've been caught. Yeah, my question, like, is that some kind of person or like, what is that? Absolute energy. Oh. oh, so they're saying like, like that energy is the thing for the revolution? Oh yeah, they, they're saying something like that, like, they, like uh, yeah, the energy helped them evolve into Oh It's just <laughs> He's not getting understanding anything. Oh. Hmm. 
<laughs> yeah. Okay, so people try to become God, something like that. But they failed, yeah. Oh, that girl is talking. I was thinking, why is she able to say so, so many things? <laughs> all right, I was thinking like, where is she getting all of this information? Um, what? <laughs> so they're, they're like using her as a medium to talk to him. Hmm, okay. Oh, damn. Great. Teso could probably wreck all of these things, you know, all of the tanks, the helicopters, just like a snap of his finger. <laughs> like he, he can like Thanos snap each and everything. <laughs> oh, great. Okay. Yeah. Oh god. Yeah, where is his bike? Like That that's not his bike. That is that his bike? Oh oh okay, this is Yamakata's bike. Okay, jump! Yeah. Yeah, he must have jumped. There you go. Oh, what the? Oh, he's here. What's, what's his name? Takeda or something? I forgot. Oh yeah, they're, they're like controlling her. Oh damn, he's she's walking on water. They vanished. Wow. You must choose how to use it. Yeah, he, he made his choice to do evil things. We want her to help us.
damn what to do in this situation like he's like a super power you know like superhero type of a person with supernatural powers <laughs> okay oh no damn Yeah, they're like doing a military uprising kind of thing. And trying... <laughs> wow. Is that money? Oh! Damn, it's a greedy... He didn't have his medication. Oh, he shot him. Damn, he himself is dying and he's shooting others. So like Ryu and the, that guy was working together. All right. Oh wow. <laughs> I don't think it'll help. You know. Yeah. Tetsuo Sama is here. He can probably <laughs> send the send your attack back to you. You know. Oh. Oh. Damn, this guy wants to be a superhero or a super villain, whatever it. I don't think the like it's of any use. He'll like return it back to you, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, okay, he did not return it back. He exploded in mid in mid air. That also works. It's Lord Akira. Wow. <laughs> Why are you even like bothering? Yeah. He still wants his money, you know? Like, that's his first priority. Even if he's dying, I'm guessing that's money in his suitcase. Oh boy, Ryu is still alive. No, those are not money, those are like some kind of certificates or something. Okay. Oh. You're overdosing on your medication, like... And he's dead. <clears throat> chaos. Complete chaos. Who's that girl who knew Tetsuo? Yeah. 
illegally ordered us to land. They are so eager to die, you know, like they are seeing that some stuff like this is happening, they still want to see what is happening. And there is bike. Don't bother, like, yeah. Like, how do you even stop this guy, you know, Tetsuo? Like, unless and until like, they nuke the place. I doubt even that will work on him, like, you know. Flames of purity. Oh god. <clears throat> oh, what are these? Oh, they're using laser. Laser beams. Oh, okay. Is there no negative, you know, like effects that he's having for using the power so much? There's usually a negative effect, you know, kind of connected with these type of things. I'm guessing the headache is the negative thing that he gets sometimes. <laughs> Wasn't he saying that don't no need to fear and he is like asking for help? Wow, everything's like. Oh yeah, he's going going to Azakira. He's going to Azakira. <clears throat> this was Sama's here. There you go. Oh my god, the way they react to stuff. Oh. Damn. Oh, okay, uh, that's so. Yeah, he, he's getting, I'm guessing this is the negative thing that happens. Like excessive headache or something. <clears throat> okay, so who is this Akira person? Or this energy what, that they're talking about? Does it have a form or is it like... Oh, is this a... Wait. Oh, this is gay. Yeah. Oh! Okay. Damn. 
Oh, they're using her as a... Oh, great. This is the job that they had for her? They're also like using... Oh my god, wow. Great. Like, they just want her to act as their proxy. That's it. Oh boy. Uh, what? Whoa, what is that? Oh my god. Okay. Oh, oh boy. They are still waiting and watching the normal people, like the spectators. Great. Now what? <laughs> That's Akira's. Yeah. Wait, what? What? Yeah. Like that's Akira? This is the energy they're talking about? They're in containers? Of Tristan Sandel. Oh my god. Oh, the... <laughs> That's just a... God damn. <laughs> Oh, this like
Oh, this is Canada is here. And that's why you are doing this? Oh! Oh damn! He caught him by surprise! Whoa! But now he is alert. Yeah. Oh! Damn, the music is like. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh. Oh, but will that Oh no, the battery is gone. Wow, great, now what? Oh, what's happening? What? Oh, what the hell is happening? Some Oh, they is it like using some kind of satellite or something? Yeah, 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 they they're using some kind of satellitic laser beam or something. Oh, this is the soul. Okay, they were talking about this. Okay. Wow, like Yeah, where? Oh, there he is. Oh, his hand. Oh, can he regenerate it or something? Or maybe? No, he cannot. Oh, another one. There comes another one. Oh, move! Oh damn, this will help him, didn't he? Yeah. Why did they target him? What the hell? Like... I'm guessing like they just like randomly targeted like a life form who was like in there. They didn't even bother checking. Like no sound because it's in space. There you go. Tracking system error. Wow. Like in, uh, the amount of incompet incompetency. <laughs> Great. What? 
<laughs> just start god damn it's like a mess yeah where <laughs> let's jump oh oh okay it's gone thank god like this so was able to shut it down Oh. Yeah, it's, it's over. Now what will they do? Do they have do they have any other kind of trump card? A scientist will be a scientist even in this situation he's like magnificent. Oh great, he made a prosthetic arm. Yeah. Mm. Like parallel world. Not parallel world, but like in branches. Look at his excitement. He's like, oh, look at this. <laughs> Colin is not happy. That's a scientist for you, you know? Wait, what is that? Oh boy, their bike got busted. Okay. Oh, this is that, that girl. Oh, wow, he, he has a custom made throne for himself. Yeah. Oh, he's here himself. Oh my god. He came here too. Oh boy. Oh. Okay. 
Yeah, he's here. Mm, yeah. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Oh no, he cannot control it anymore. Yeah. Oh, is Canada here? Yeah. And he has his laser beam fully recharged now. <laughs> okay. Okay. Damn, that's a sturdy bike, you know? Oh! And... Oh! This guy is here. Oh, and he's here as well. What are they trying to do? Phew! Yeah, what are they trying to do? Like, the sneaking out? Oh. Oh. Oh no. Oh god. This is what happens when you use a power Ah, weird. Weird demon baby. What the hell? Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. He, he's also. What? Yeah, yeah. Oh boy. Oh no.
Oh god. Yeah, he's like firing his gun randomly. Okay, that worked kind of. Ah. Oh. Yeah, what are they doing? They're like praying to the Akira. Oh. Okay. Okay, something. Oh, was that it? So that thing was somehow connected with what was happening to him? Yeah. Oh, so the whole place is blowing up. Something is happening. Okay, he's reverting back. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Yeah. See, he's like bullied and everything. Whoa.
Oh, this is that girl. And I'm guessing this is Takahashi or what was her, his name? And this is that kid who's like. And is this Akira? Yeah, this is Akira. And they were like experimented upon and like they were on medication. Yeah, he was also one of them. Yeah, like they were unable to control it. Oh my god, what's happening? <laughs> Whoa! This is what happens when you try experimenting upon things that you should not, you know. <laughs> Birth of a new, wow. Like the big, damn. Oh. Ah! Damn, the car is like falling. Ugh. Like the whole place was like, you know, kind of like a dystopian society and like it's like it's looking like it more now. Like, you know, like a post-apocalyptic setting. Yeah, like look at this. Like everything's like flooded and the buildings are like all broken. Oh. 
Oh, there he is. That's it. I guess I Yeah. He was was he thinking that he's dead? He was thinking that Canada's dead. Yeah. Yeah, who knows? Maybe he's okay. Damn. Oh, he's he's still okay. Yeah, he like he went under the bridge, so. Oh, what happened in the end? Like, did he like, you know, uh, like this? So like, kind of became a, uh, like, you no. Know, what can I say? Like, like the universe itself, or something. Like, you know, like he kind of got assimilated into the universe, or something like that. Did it happen? Something like that. I don't know. Like in the end, like it's like uh, something like that was implied. I'm guessing. I'm not sure. I might be wrong. But okay, so this is um so this is Akira and uh there were a few parts which were I'm guessing No, it was quite easy to understand. Like I kind of like I understood what was actually happening and what you know what was the case. So this was basically like uh these like scientists they were um like experimenting on this akira this like energy like this thing that they were talking about and like these kids like who were experimented upon they were kind of i think they were like kind of vessels in which they were trying to put the energy but as they said that we are like not you know uh, powerful enough to contain it so that's why like they were unable to control it and uh like i think akira there's like a kid with them who was called akira who was also like one of the experimented kids and uh like uh, i'm guessing like that power was too much for for him and he also like kind of got assimilated into that whole power and just like how tetsuo is now you know kind of got assimilated uh akira was also happened uh, like something like that also happened to akira and that's why like they were like uh, these kind of like test tubes where inside which there was like Akira's, you know, uh, nerves, like nerves and other body parts, bits and pieces of, they were like being preserved. So that was like Akira, the power. So like, it was like a weird, um, like a weird entity that was Akira. Like Akira had been like, the Akira the boy, he had been like uh, mixed in with that power which he was unable to control. That's why like uh, the colonel, he said that uh, like that's all that's left of Akira, you know, like these test tubes, uh, something like that. I'm guessing it's something like that. And the kids were there and they were trying to stop the experimentation that's happening. 
that was happening and yeah it was something like that but still like these you know these scientists and all of them were still trying to like tap into that thing like you know like they're scientists they want to see uh like whenever they get something scientific uh like whenever they find something <clears throat> like fascinating whatever happens they don't care because they're scientists uh just like that like they were trying to get try to control that power of god as they were saying and they messed up and that's why like all of this happened they like tried to do the same thing to tesuo they kidnapped tesuo because tesuo showed a little bit more potential i'm guessing after he came into contact with uh one of the other kids and that's why like they captured tesuo tried to do experiment on him okay that's the end tried to do experiment on him and tried to make him the vessel and they were like thinking oh maybe tesuo would be able to control it then we would have the power of god with us Unfortunately, Tetsu was also like Tetsu kind of controlled it, but not fully. So he like kind of went, um, you know, kind of went crazy in the end. Like he was unable to control his whole power, and uh, yeah, and things got messed up. So <clears throat> so yeah, this was Akira, and um. Yeah, it was a good movie. I quite enjoyed it, even though it was a little bit in the beginning, like stuff were happening uh, like so quickly. It, it was a little bit difficult to actually understand what's happening. You know, I think I was like uh, the first 30 minutes. I was like, what's happening here? Like, <laughs> like what's even happening? Like there's these weird kids. They're like uh, weird, like old kids, like running around. And then there's like these kind of things happening. <laughs> but after that uh it started to start like slowly to explaining stuff to us and we were able to understand stuff and <clears throat> then like um yeah and then what else yeah that's basically it like that's the story like this is like uh they were uh like Tesso came into contact with this kid who was like running away was trying to run away and um he came into contact with the kid that's why he got that power within him which was the reason why he was captured by them by the scientists they tried to do experiments on him to make him like well suited as a vessel for the power but unfortunately he became too powerful on his own and started wrecking the whole place and also his own uh, inferiority complex his own you know like mm, like jealousy envy uh, uh, like all of those kind of things kind of made him do the stuff that he was doing you know he kind of lashed around and like he got drunk on his newfound power and uh, that's how like he kind of went out of line and then like uh, the colonel guy he like sieged the whole situation like he said that like when you know like uh, the people came and uh, like pointed a gun at him and said that you are like striped of all your powers like go back you know like go back and sit down on your couch you don't have to do anything else he like seized the situation killed that guy and decided to take control of the military himself and did like a military uprising which was better i think in this situation at least because he at least was trying to stop the situation if like it was left on those people's hands they would have done nothing they would have like sat you know like sat and like like try to control the uh, they would probably try to take the power for themselves and would fail that would have happened but at least this guy tried to you know kind of stop the what was happening try to <clears throat> like stop uh let's go just a sec guys so yeah as i was saying that um yeah so as i was saying so like they tried to like he tried to uh, bring the uh, thing into control and he brought it under control uh, kind of in a way but obviously like uh Tesu's power was too much like even if he was like he did a minuscule amount of stuff which kind of helped in the end you know he kind of went there and like pointed the gun at Tesuo, which kind of like stalled him for the moment when like kaneda came in and this like and that like he stopped him and yeah like things were all good uh like at least he tried to do something you know and uh, thankfully he is like all right in the end and yeah and then like as i was saying so then um 
what else um uh, yeah and i think like like kaneda he was able to stop that so because of one reason he like kaneda was his friend you know so like that's why tetsu would probably only talk to him like at least he, they were like able to interact with each other if it was someone else who tried to come and to stop tetsu he would have like at that moment he would have died because tetsu would have killed him in that moment but at least like kaneda came when kaneda came he at least stopped and listened to him and that was like the only thing that tetsu and like them they needed for to for seizing the victory and he also helped tetsu you know uh when like this so i think probably was going to die two times yeah two times one was when the uh like that thing that soul or whatever like that uh satellite beam that was coming that tried to like you know like fell on him and like uh tesso made a force field around him that was the first time and second time was when this um things were breaking and like trying to fall on his head he would have died then as well and that's oh no that oh, oh sorry that was not him i forgot that was the other kid okay so he saved him only one time but still you know like it's like he saved him from his death so yeah and uh what else was i trying to say oh yeah and then um <coughs> in the end uh like, okay so i like the whole thing with tetsu like his uh, complex uh he was bullied as far as we could see and it's also like we can see that kaneda came and helped him now i think the thing that tetsu felt about kaneda was frustration you know like and envy a little bit because like <laughs> like i cannot say anything like that but like uh kaneda kind of treated him like uh, you know like ah oh, like you can't do this uh like he was a bit cocky like a bit too much cocky but that was not because like you know he hated him or because he did not like him no that was not it it was like you know like how friends do like you you like what can i say like sometimes you feel that yeah i i i have like said too many things like and i probably like shouldn't have said this to my friend but you kind of like go like over the line and that was what was happening like they like cared about each other but and that was like made him frustrated and he thought that oh like he doesn't care about me i am like he thinks that i'm a baby like i can't do anything f for myself that's why like that kind of thing kind of made him uh like start using the power you know like and so like ra rashly so badly and he uh like became this kind of uncontrol uncontrollable like beast and <clears throat> yeah that was like in a way it was a little bit of kaneda's fault as well because how he treated him but i cannot fault him for it too much because like like i've been like you know i have friends like uh in, in my like uh you know like uh, previously when i like interacted with my friends there were people like this you know like a, a type of a peep person who would probably like you know kind of bully you like go like you know like kind of mess with you and say a lot of things which you do not like but in the end he is not that he's bad or he doesn't like you it's just you know his personality he like interacts with his friends like this a few of, of his friends and that doesn't mean that he doesn't like you he cares about you and he likes you definitely but that's just him you know that's just his way of like friendship like i've seen a few people like this you know like like i i i remember like i had like a friend who used to kind of um not bully but mess with another of his friend he used to continuously mess with him and you know kind of like bad mouth him and like it's kind of like a toxic type of a relationship the friendship was kind of toxic but in the end they were friends you know like they were good friends like both of them they like even though that happened like they like they were kind of like best friends in a way <laughs> even though like in the other like one of them like uh, kind of messed with the other so it's kind of like that like i i don't think that is like a healthy type of friendship it's kind of like a toxic type of friendship but in the end if like you know if the other person cared about you i think it's probably fine but a lot of people are unable to you, you know like what can i say like bear that like the part party who is getting messed with like if he is like you know like um it's unable to uh bear with it he might become like tetsu here 
you know, like Tetsuo was unable to bear with it because in, in the beginning I was kind of thinking like, what the hell are they even doing? Like, uh, like, like they left Tetsuo in the hospital. Like they didn't even care. They thought, ah, Tetsuo, like he'll be fine. He'll come back, something like that. And they didn't even bother like, uh, like asking about it, him when they come, came out. And when they really understood that, yeah, he is really in a messed up situation. That's when they like started to like panic and decided to go and help him. But it was kind of like a, you know, uh, like a friendship, which is um, like, yeah, like this is like a other type of a friendship that like there's like one type of friendship where like people are extremely, you know, like they show that, yeah, I care about you. Uh, you're my friend, something like that. There's another type of friendship where like people mess with you and it's like all jokes and everything. And there's like another type of friendship where like it seems as if like one, another, one person is bullying you. But at the same time, he's a friend. Like, there's a lot of type of friendship. But unfortunately, like, they so kind of, like, you know, uh, became bothered by that. And that's why, like, there's, like, the, the thing got into him that, yeah, like, I must be strong. I, I must become strong. Like, uh, I cannot be in, like, Kaneda's shadow forever. I'll have to, like, do something for myself. And that's how he messed everything up. He, like, lost control of his power. And in the end, like, stuff like this happened like it's a sad thing and yeah and in the end i really un was unable to understand what happened mm, i'm guessing uh like Tetsuo, as they said that uh like we will probably come back and I i'm guessing like Tetsuo got assimilated with the universe or whatever and like there's like this kind of uh, a voice that was like being uh was coming out and yeah like i'm really not sure what happened in the end like let me just check that portion like the whole place kind of blew up a lot of people died a few of them were okay they were the, like showing this kind like when <laughs> the scientist guy he said that a new universe is being formed it's as if like a new universe is being formed <laughs> excuse me and then they're just, like showing this kind of a weird thing like as if you're going inside a tunnel or something <clears throat> like you know and it, and there's like this voice like it's saying that i'm tetsuo and then it suddenly ends so i'm guessing it's something like that you know like he became one with the universe or something like that like you know because he like he, like yeah like that's what happened in the end like he kind of like blew up no not blew up but he got uh like something happened weird happened in the end so yeah like like the way i interpret it is something like that that he got assimilated with the universe and this really reminded me of mob psycho you know like uh, how like there's this kind of espers like they were kind of like espers like you know like they're like using telekinetic powers one was using uh, like spread of cognition and uh, yeah like these kind of things and another was uh, kind of like using illusions and stuff so it's kind of like that <clears throat> and yeah <clears throat> so yeah that was it that was this movie i it was enjoyable and um what can I say? Like, <clears throat> I'm guessing that there are a lot of things that I probably wasn't able to catch, you know? Like, I think there are a few portions where I was unable to grasp what the whole situation is. But I think I understood the movie properly. Like, like what was actually happening and what they were trying to tell us, you know? Even though like each and everything like like a few things might have like went up like you know past my head, but I was able to understand it. And yeah, as I was saying, like they were not ready for this power. Like this is like a power of, of God, and they were trying to like contain that power within a human body, human vessel or something. And obviously, like <clears throat> none of them were able to control it and like in the end like uh, you know like what ha you saw what happened and yeah like like that's humans you know like 
like scientists are like that you, you saw that scientists when like everything was like getting wrecked and like the whole world was like you know like <clears throat> the whole world was kind of like collapsing he was still like in his like laboratory and saying that oh what is this look at this like so amazing like uh, <laughs> he was so fascinated like that's a scientist he doesn't care what happens like scientists are like that like like experiment and experiment they like always kind of like uh focus on the experimentation part and otherwise whatever happens like most of them i'm not saying that all of them like uh like most of them like they like the experimentation is the only thing uh, at least that's what i've seen from animes i'm not sure how it actually happens in the real world uh yeah because like you know i i, I don't know any kind of scientist but still like in, in anime i've seen this a lot like you know like scientists they kind of like are so obsessed with the result and the experimentation they really doesn't care about anything else so yeah that's just like what i saw from the anime and that's also like what happened here like this guy was so happy like ah like we have finally <laughs> we're finally able to control the power of the god and then he dies i doubt he even cared that he like you know i, I doubt he himself like cared about his own life he just wanted like you know the knowledge and everything that's like kind of you know uh fascinating and commendable in a way because you know you're so like into it that you don't doesn't don't even care what happens uh, outside it so yeah in a way it's commendable in a way it's not commendable like you know yeah like in the moral perspective of it it's not commendable at all like you know but if you look into the scientific aspect of it it's extremely commendable because like you really do not care about anything except the result but if you like look at it through the lens of morality that's extremely wrong so yeah yeah that was a nice movie i enjoyed it and uh, yeah um that was it oh i think there's like another like thing related to akira coming out I, i'm not sure I, I think that i saw something like that did i like uh, akira shin or something like that let me just quickly check it yeah there it is alternative version is going to come out sometime in the future this is called akira shin and we don't even know what this actually is is this an anime is this a movie what it is so yeah like i don't know like uh, when it comes out probably we'll like i'll like check it out you know do a reaction or something if it's a movie or if it's like a uh, anime i'm not sure but yeah like i'll probably check it out so yeah so thank you guys for watching this was akira and as i said like i enjoyed it quite a bit and like i won't say that yeah this is like amazing so good like i did not feel that much about this it was a good movie i enjoyed it but yeah like um it, it was good like that's it like it's not exceptional but it's really good i enjoyed myself quite a bit and uh so yeah guys thank you guys for watching and okay so let me uh, just uh like decide what i'll do next week all right the uh fate uh franchise the heavens theme uh, field franchise the three movies that we have all of them has are out now so i'm going to start the heaven fields franchise it will take three weeks i'm guessing because it has three movies so like in each week i'll do one movie so in the next week i'm doing uh fate day night movie heavens field number one presage flower and yeah like like it'll take two three weeks to complete it and i'm quite excited because I, I like kept myself, I did not like, I think uh, the first movie was aired in 2017. I was able to <laughs> stop myself from watching it because I really wanted to watch all of them at the same time. And in like 2019, I, I think I started YouTube. And so I thought that why not like make a reaction video out of it when all of it comes out. So yeah, it's finally all of them are out. So I'm going to start doing this. So the next week, Fate Stay Night, Heaven's Feel uh, Part 1, Presage Flower. I'm going to do it. So thank you guys for watching. So this was Akira. If you guys enjoyed my reaction, be sure to press the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed, consider doing so because it helps me a lot. And 
yeah and i'll be happy <laughs> and um and comment down below anything you want to say or anything you want to share about this anime or anything in general if you want to have any kind of uh, suggestions uh be sure to like post that in the comment section as well i'll definitely do them so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video uh, next week with uh, face day night movie so until then goodbye and have a nice day